Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a DIY clay wash on my hair. The clay that I'm using today is the Indian Healing Clay. I didn't use this last year. I said I was going to do it when I shaved my head. I was just gonna do a whole detox, but I never ended up doing it for some reason. I did a clay wash. It was from Cream of Nature. That was okay, but I didn't get to do my DIY clay wash that I usually do on a fairly somewhat inconsistent, irregular basis. But yeah, so this is the first time I'm gonna be using it this year, 2021. And I'm on a journey to grow my edges back and my hair back from my postpartum shedding. And I've been trying different things. I've been trying different oils. And as of late, I've been trying another oil, a wild growth hair oil. I mentioned that in my previous video, but I wanted to give rice water a try. But before I started using rice water, I wanted to just clear my scalp, clear my hair, clear everything, start fresh, start clean. And I figured that using a clay wash would do that for me. So yeah, that's why I wanted to do it now. And I hope to do it more often this year. So I just wanted to show you what my hair was looking like before I put the clay in. My hair is dry. I have a leave-in, my oil, my cream from a few nights ago. And this is what my hair is looking like now. I have some oil on my edges. So now I'm gonna show you how I prepare my clay mask. So I use Health and Beauty Aztec Secret Indian Healing Clay. It's 100% natural calcium bentonite clay. And I just love this brand. I've been using it for years. I use it mainly for my hair, but I also use it on my face as well. And when I'm making my mixture, I don't use exact measurements. I just kind of eyeball it as I go. And I love bentonite clay. It's a natural way to add moisture to your hair as well as remove toxins. It's great for dry scalp, dry hair, frizz, dandruff. And most importantly, it helps cleanse the hair follicles, removing dead skin cells from the scalp. Once I have everything in my bowl, I mix. And then I generally mix until I get the consistency that I like, which is usually like a yogurt consistency. Before I put any clay in my hair, my hair is pretty dry. So I find that it's easier to distribute the clay throughout my hair if I spray my hair with some water. massaging it in now. This is what my hair is looking like. My hair looks good. So Miss Ashley's doing one as well. These are her curls before. And this is with the clay. So now I'm gonna leave it in for about 20 to 30 minutes and then I'm gonna rinse. Okay, this is what my hair is looking like with the clay all rinsed out. Now that I'm all detoxed, now I'm ready for the rice water. So stay tuned for that, and thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.